Greetings lords and ladies, Kaiser here and welcome to another episode of Mountain Blade Gekko Kujo Daimyo Edition. Now you might be thinking, why am I still at Kyoto? Well, the reason is because while it took me about, I believe, two days, you know, I was going along with the plan. I was gonna wait here for three or four more days and just keep buying sake for the people. However, this happened. A tournament suddenly started, so we will be doing this tournament. Not to mention, oh wow, it is the uh, big price tournament. So, as per usual, I will do the first tournament on camera, the rest I'll probably do off camera, that was actually scary. Because I know that that Kanabo can actually one-hit people, as we've noticed, of course, even if you block it, <laughs> there's a very, very big chance that you're just gonna fall. Baron Maru. You don't exactly look like a young boy. <laughs> Apparently, Ranmaru... I don't know if you guys, like, how many of you actually watch anime and, stu and such, but... Uh, or know Japanese culture that much. But there's this term, Bishonen, which pretty much just means pretty boy. It's like all those, um, butler anime and manga and everything. Basically, the very, very ridiculously good-looking guys. Possibly even slightly uh, feminized. At any rate, uh, Ranmaru was supposedly a very feminine individual, a very feminine, uh, well, man slash boy, <laughs> uh, and was apparently also Nobunaga's lover, which comes down to. When we come down to it, I actually read that, oh wow, it was actually me versus the Shogun. Nice! You know what, I'm just gonna continue this feast, though, or rather continue these tournaments and just keep until I finish the story. Basically, uh, if you guys remember, like two or three episodes ago, we talked about why Akechi Mitsuhida actually uh, betrayed Nobunaga. And I mentioned how uh, he betrayed him because he heard, or rather he was commanded by Nobunaga to uh, go and support Hideyoshi, uh, Toyotomi Hideyoshi, who uh, of course, well, was a very, uh, was a lowborn general, who usually in normal times, like 50 years before the Sengoku Jidai, would definitely not even, like, ever be able to um, gain the position of general like he did. Uh, and I actually read that another reason that Akechi Mitsuhide rebelled against uh, Nobunaga Oda was because he heard that apparently Nobunaga was going to give one of Mitsuhide's uh, thieves, rather one of his main thieves, I believe, to his quote-unquote lover, um... Ranmaru. That, ju that story just came to mind now that we actually saw Ranmaru. <laughs> Even though it's not- Ow! Thank you! Jeez. It actually cut off before I could do it, but I tried kicking him. <laughs> okay, so this is basically Yukimura versus me, and it's over! And the tournament's over as well. Oh, okay. That went by pretty quick. At any rate, guys, I will make a cut right here. And, you know, as per, all, as per usual, I will continue doing the uh, tournaments in this town until the feast is over. By the looks of it, we'll be able to actually open our enterprise here very, very soon. But at any rate, guys, I will see you guys in just a little bit. Hello everyone, we are back. Uh, I tried going through one night, there was no more, there were, sorry, not was, were no more tournaments. Uh, but apparently, they, I just got a message that another Lord defect, Lord Umezu, has renounced his allegiance to the Date clan and joined the Amako clan. 
pretty sure that's very unrealistic. That was that guy was one of the most uh, loyal officers to the Dante clan. But okay, so the Dante clan lost a lord. I guess they will be in the need of another one, huh? At any rate, guys. Uh, well, the populace is accepted to us, so that's a 9. Let's see if we can bump that up to a 10. Here's some money for some sake. A thousand mon, like that? That's actually expensive, but then again, I guess we're actually buying sake for the entire town at this point. We will take a walk around the street, meet the guildmaster, see what kind of enterprises we can open. Oh, God, I actually got jumped again, really. Alright, where you at? You were, what, a salesperson, I believe? And you're just randomly standing there in the middle of a... Wait. Oh, no, my bad. Oh, damn. <laughs> I confused myself there. Um, Right, I clicked to take a walk around the street, and because it took so long to actually load, I thought that it had the... I mean, that we were going to take part in the sequence where we get jumped on. Can I establish myself as a merchant? Excellent, I can. Alright, so what is the raw sil- Wow, that is a very big minus. Definitely not. Definitely not. Okay, so let's see what- yeah, I can actually get minus. That's still a minus. No. Yeah. All right, that's a profit of a 231. That's good. That was what? What was that? That was uh, sake from rice. All right, urushi sap. 200. All right, all right, all right. That's even better. Uh, soybeans. I mean, at least it's in the plus, but that's not a very big plus. Uh, awful. No, that's a minus. Mm, iron. <laughs> that's a very big minus. All right. Uh, we already checked the silk, and that's still a minus. It seems like it's gonna be the Urushi Sap. Minus, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, whoa, 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 whoa. That is all. I misclicked. So Urushi Sap, right? Uh, the, uh, my profit would be 200. All right, so that's 8,000 mon. Sure, here you go. So we didn't even lose as much as we could have. Uh, at any rate, wait, we cannot visit the arena right now, but we can. I actually forgot to check, I just talked with the innkeeper. We still have two prisoners, so let's see if we can actually sell those guys off. Get at least a little bit of those 8,000 mon that we just lost back. That's a belligerent drunk. Alright, let's see. Hello. Get knocked out. Such a waste, indeed. Why did the people downstairs actually run <laughs> when this happened? <laughs> that makes very little sense, but okay. Uh, oh, wait, I forgot to... Oh, ooh, I forgot to give stuff to my papal. Alright. Uh, at any rate, like we said, we will be going... Wait, do we have anything open in Nara? Do we have anything open in Nara? We do not. So do we actually just, like I said, if we go from Kyoto to Kyoto to Kyosu to Hamamatsu, Kakegawa, Odawara, Edo, Toshi, Mito, and Sendai, or do we actually also go to Nara? We go for Kyosu. <laughs> uh, we will go for Kyosu. We are, of course, still paying attention around this. If there's anything of interest veteran Asakura Spearman let me see can we actually fight these guys probably what kind of prisoners do you have come on uh trained Asakura Spearman veteran Asakura Spearman okay so these guys are better uh so we will be taking the field and we will just try and skirmish with these guys though of course to do that we need the high ground Alright, so let's just start firing. Mm. It's a very weird position. Alright, we'll do it like that. And so one of them is already down. Hatamoto Gunner. Oh wow, that's still an Otomo Hatamoto Gunner. That's like one of the gunners that we've had since the very beginning. He's still around. Good for him.
Alright, yeah, these guys are gonna get decimated before they even get to here. Which is good, which is good, which is a very good plan. Can we actually manage to hit a few more? So they're trying to get up the hill. Let's command the infantry to actually go in, and definitely not the cavalry. And I will try and sneak in behind like that. So I got one of them. Elite Data Spearman killed. So these three are definitely paying attention to me. I need to get to somewhere where they're not paying attention to me. Like this guy! Boom! Did I get him? No. Okay, he died before I did. Oh, there's one more! Please don't kill him, please don't kill him, please don't kill him, please don't shoot. I mean, of course they're gonna keep shooting. No! <laughs> but at least we see the proficiency of the elite on Abushis. Alright, so battle's over. We lost the Dota Spearman, we got two veteran... Uh, what were they? Asakura Spearman, I believe? Alright, uh, Isusan Gamal also leveled up. Uh, we will be taking all of the women. That sounds wrong, but still, yes, we will be taking all of the women. That, those are some good armors and stuff. Wow. Alright, yeah, definitely worth it. I feel sorry for saying that, considering we actually lost the guy, like, it's that's not very nice to say about him. I mean, considering he died, but, hey. Uh, what can you tell me about your skills? So, Issa Sangamad, I keep forgetting because I keep restarting this, uh, foraging, foraging, right, so we need to increase your agility. Huh, uh, what else can we actually give you? Let's give you some more writing, I suppose. Yeah, that's good, that's good, that's good. And two-handed weapons, of course. Katanas. Uh, that's it as far as this goes. Do we go for two? Let me just check because I didn't write down what our standing in two actually is. And I'm pretty sure the women are ready to level up. Yep, that's it. Uh, two, 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 two. Uh, <laughs> so it's a zero. Alright, so we won't be bothering with this place right now. I just took down the... Uh, the note. Uh, any tournaments anytime soon? Nope. Alright then. What? Alrighty then, is what I was gonna say. Alright, so we're heading to Kyosu. Are you guys at war with anybody? Are you guys fighting anybody? Those are Saito. Are you. Are they running? No, they're. Who are the Oda currently at war with? Let's just go ahead and check, alright? Uh, true subjects, Takeda recently provoked, alright, so the Takeda clan's at war with them, the Miyoshi clan's at war with them, the Nanbo clan is at war with them, Hojo clan, and the Imagawa clan, oh no, there's a risk of war, oh my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, okay, uh, so there's been a lot of provocations, even with the Saito clan, okay, so they're definitely not at war with those guys, just yet at least. Uh, let's head to Kyosu. Oh, wow, it's really just the three here? I actually forgot. Oh, right, I do have it in my notes. Uh, I mean, let's just Himeji. Oh, that's back in, um, back closer to Tenjinyama, if I'm not mistaken. There's a farmer here, so we might as well go and help this good man. Uh, what was the village? Kuana. So it's the guys that I believe I tried into- Oh! Wait, that's a battle. Is it? Come on, come on, come on! Stop! Uh, Lord Akagawa's party versus General Shichiri. And the battle's over. Alright. Ah, I missed it. I didn't see it in time. Alright, so if I'm not mistaken- Oh no, the populace is indifferent to you. Which uh, village did we actually go and try to extort for taxes then? Uh, cavalry? No, 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 no. It is a very bad idea for you guys to just rush in. Alright, never mind. Don't listen to me then. Musashi. Tisk, tisk, tisk. I mean, they're weak, at least. One shot, one kill. Peasant men are being killed! And now. 
Stop killing the people I'm supposed to protect. I missed. I missed miserably. Again. Can I... Good, good, good job! <laughs> I, I helped! To be fair, I actually shot a few. Oh, you can keep everything. As long as you like me. Good, good, they like me. Onabushi. Train Onabushi. Alright, so both Musashi and Goemon got knocked out. Alright, alright, alright. So let's head back to Kyosu. Uh, let's see... Wait, there was just a farmer, right? But is there... Yeah, there's no slaver. I mean, um, the ransom broker. Yeah, that's what they are. <laughs> Alright, so I will do the exact same thing I did in Kyoto, guys. So I will be making a cut right here until I can buy sufficient amounts of uh, sake for the town. Because if I remember correctly, I don't... Or rather, maybe I don't remember correctly. But I believe that it is worth to actually open a dye workshop in Kyosu. We will see. We still have plenty of money. We even got pretty much the entirety of the... Um, Enterprise that we opened in Kyoto, everything was pretty much paid by the tournament we won there. So yeah, I will see you guys in just a little bit. I will t also take this time to just uh, upgrade my troops, I mean their equipment. So yeah, see you guys in just a little bit. Hello and welcome back everyone. Well, wouldn't you know it, if we wait in a city or at a town, god damn it, a town. Long enough, this happens! There is now a tournament in Kyosu as well, and we will be taking full advantage of that. We will basically, I mean, it's been, I believe, three nights since I've came to Kyosu, so three nights worth of sake to get back the money for. I believe that was grammatically correct, it might not have been. <laughs> At any rate, that was the first round. Second round incoming. That was like they were very aggressive in the last one. Uh, veteran height of warrior, elite onaboshi. Opa. So that's a lord. Kambei. Is that Kambei Kuroda? He was one of the. I believe. Hmm. If I remember correctly, he was like a lord to the Oda, but Nobunaga actually exiled him for a while. Uh, as if to try and teach him something, and then he came back and was like one of the best generals in the Oda army. If he's the guy that I'm thinking about correctly. That's one. That was my ally. He got in the way. Not my fault. Ouch. Sorry for the silence, guys. That was a bit... Whew. That was a bit scary. Sorry, Mei Ling. Kind of used you as a meat shield there. Oh, she's still in. Good. Good. Is it... I was gonna say, is it possible that it might be me and Mei Ling in the fight? Oh, it might still be. That was an elite Onabushi. No. Ha! Mei Ling? How did you get defeated by a regular fighter? I know they can be sneaky. Like, believe it or not, guys, in the melee fights, the regular fighters were actually some of the most cancerous ones, so to speak. <laughs> uh, Alright, so the populace is, ex is acceptive to us. That was an additional 4,000 mon, so basically, yeah, we more or less got everything back that we lost. But at any, at any rate, I know that this episode is having a lot of cuts, but hey, I think it's better than just having you guys, you know, just wait with me. For all of the days and nights that go by. But yeah. Uh, also, our lady is expecting us in about three weeks. A bit less than three weeks. So we definitely want to get a move on as soon as possible from Kyosu. We might even skip uh, some of the towns. Either that or go up there and head back. Like, for instance, I don't know. Perhaps do Kyosu, do Hamamatsu. Since Hamamatsu is very, very close, I believe. Yeah, it's at a, at a 7 Kakegawa is at a zero, so we'll probably skip that one. Odawara, I have it on ten, but I guess we still need to increase our standing. Am I correct in believing that we have to increase our standing with Great Lord Hojo? Do I remember correctly? No, that was not. Return to main menu. Uh, Lords by relation. Yeah, Great Lord Hojo. He still kind of dislikes us. Okay, so... <laughs> oh, the water's probably out of the question as well. So, Edo... Edo's at zero, so we'll just skip that as well. 
Choshi, we do not know yet, so we will go visit Choshi, Mito, and then Iwaki Castle, meet our lady, after which we will go to Sendai, and we will finally declare our allegiance. It's been a long time coming, but I think it'll all be worth it. At any rate, guys, I will see you in just a bit. Hello and welcome back, everyone. Here we go. We... Uh, did what? What was that? Seven more tournaments in Kyoso, out of which, sadly enough, we lost the very last one in, I believe, the fifth round, and Great Lord Oda actually ended up winning that. But we did gain a lot of the money back, and as such, we will now speak to the Guildmaster and see just what we can actually do. Alright, let's see myself as a merchant. There we go. Alright, so the die There we go. That's the kind of profit we want and yes We will automatically just build that because I know that nothing could provide more profit than that excellent Additionally what we will do is simply sell off all of these uh, Armor and equipment there we go. So all in all we lost if I remember correctly when we came to Kyoso we had about 53,000 or was it even 49,000? But yeah, in the end, all in all, we lost, what, 5,000 in all of that, thanks to the tournaments and thanks to, well, the enterprises everywhere else. Everywhere. Nice. Everywhere else. Not being that expensive. Uh, I was also thinking, visit the lady comes up in 16 days. I don't know if we can actually get there in 16 days, to be completely honest. Especially if we want to make one or two more stops. So we might actually let the lady down one more time. But, you know what? Hmm. I was gonna say it's worth it but I just remembered how a certain Lord that's in a battle right there ended up taking my woman away from me last time I thought that still no slave person alright so let's just head to Hamamatsu we will most likely do the exact same thing there that we've been doing everywhere else but after Hamamatsu we will just straight up go to Iwaki Castle. And once we're done in Iwaki Castle, we might as well just head back to Mito and Choshi to see if we can do anything there. And after that, go back to Sendai. So that is the plan for now. Uh, let us get to Hamamatsu. Let's see what's going on in there. There's a lot of lords around. I was hoping that it might have been for a tournament, but apparently not. Alright, so we're heading into the inn. There's a farmer here. That's pretty good. Experience Shinobi. I mean, they look badass, if nothing else. Alright, so let's get you some sake. Ah, uh, But still no slave person. Alright. Uh, well, <laughs> I will make another cut right here, like I said. And I will see you guys in just... Very sorry about that, guys. But I kind of just realized that we went past the farmer and didn't offer our assistance. So we will be doing that right now. Village of Kosai. Alright, also another thing I actually want to do, uh, Great Lord Tokugawa is the Lord of Hamamatsu. Uh, let me just check that we actually have favorable relations with the man. Because it would be a pain to just find out if he actually doesn't like us. Alright, so Great Lord Tokugawa, he's indifferent to us, that's good, that's very good. Alright, so uh, we are heading to Kosai, it has been looted apparently. There we go, we are almost in the green... Of course, this number will go up again once we actually head to Nipotei, uh, to our fortress in Hokkaido, and retrieve our troops from there. Because we will require those in order to successfully wage war. Let me just get the cavalry up there, because I know that you both have air bow and arrows as well. Okay, maybe up there. Shinano rebels, they all have... Well, most of them have bow and arrows, so let's try and be somewhat safe. Peasant man killed by Shinano Rebel. That's not good. What are you doing here? Alright, everybody, charge. Uh, let me see, can we get into the back line? Oh wow, a lot of peasants are dying. 
Well, because this time they actually have the high ground and everything. How are you not... Yeah, Kuroshida indeed. How am I missing? The heck is going on? Wow, that's a skeleton right there. <laughs> Wait, how? Seriously, don't I have like a balanced katana? No, I have a balanced naginata, my bad. I'd love to have a masterwork. A masterwork katana, that is. Is there any more? There's one more. And that's it. Alright, so what did we lose? Oh, damn. We lost a lot in that. That. Ooh. That, that, that hurts. Lord E. There's a tournament here, at least. Uh, <laughs> we might get something back for it. Not to mention. Um, we only need one more relation in order to be able to build something in this town. So yeah, this is all good. Everything's not exactly going according to plan, but hey. I have a bow and arrow, let me get behind everybody! Jesus! That wasn't even meant- those things weren't even meant to hit me! Like, they were swinging at my teammates, and they just hit- happened to hit me. Alright, so, we will be doing another one that- we're not ending the episode on that, for- <laughs> God, no. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's head it back in. It'd be great if our- if our archer actually did something. He's not exactly doing anything. But, sure. We will most likely actually just do this one tournament and just straight up run towards uh, Iwaki Castle. And yes, I realize I just said that I, we will be skipping tournaments, which is something I would usually never say. However, uh, we've kind of been gone from Sendai for about two months now, so... Our Lady Hina might actually have gotten a suitor of some sort, and if there is a suitor, I definitely want to get rid of him as soon as possible. And I can't really get rid of him unless I unless I know about him, and I don't know about him unless she tells me, and she can't tell me unless I actually visit her. I know, the difficulties of courting. Oh god, I thought it was gonna be a one-shot. Oh, it's Keiji, of course it wasn't gonna be a one-shot, okay. And there we go, we won the tournament, we are at 10. Let us meet the Guildmaster, let us try and build something nice here. Uh, so, Dice Workshop, possibly, yes, that is lovely, lovely money. Uh, let me check the goods, yeah, we're, we're still at 30,000, mom, that's... Solid, that's very, very solid, so we won't really be worrying about that just yet. Uh, let's buy some more food for our men, shall we? Miso. Alright, yeah, like that. Uh, we will not be joining the feast. Let me just check if there's maybe a slave. Nope. No, I didn't want to meet the guildmaster again. Ah! Leave. Leave. Thank you. Alright, uh, we will only go to Kakagawa just to check the um, inn, if there's perhaps a slave person, uh, there's a farmer, I mean, we can at least help one more farmer out, maybe, marauding bandits, say Nukata, so it's this one, alright, let's see what we can do, wait, before we do that, we have a bunch of people we have to train up, uh, plus upgrade William. Let's get your strength up a bit more. Uh, throwing two-handed weapon. No, 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 we, we realized this mistake last time. And I just realized that even in this episode, I actually put Isosangemat, Isosangemat's proficiencies into two-handed weapons. I just realized that. God damn it. Oh, uh, Musashi, you're supposed to be our tactician, if I'm not mistaken? Yep. 
Sorry for that high voice, high pitch. <laughs> uh, power draw, power strike, let's do that. Let's give you some more archery. You actually managed to do very well in a recent tournament. Uh, with your archery skills, so let's head to Nukata. Oh no, Shinan Rebels. Okay, so we can probably expect quite a few more uh, casualties. Where are they? Oh, there they are. Probably gonna get shot at, like, a lot. Our men are slow. Way, way too slow. I'll just take out this thing. Because I feel like I'm not one-shotting enough with my katana. At least this thing one-shots. I know that I'm not getting any prisoners from this, of course. Why do they have spears? I don't like spears. Spears are... Spears bad. Spears are bad. Whew. There we go. God, you're all funneled in there. That's not good, but uh, I mean, at least the enemy isn't exactly taking advantage of it. Peasant man killed. Yeah, okay. As long as they're just peasants and not my actual troops, I'm fine with it. I have no idea what that swing was at. I know what that was at. Uh, one more, one more right there. Ah! Dodge me. Didn't dodge him though. <laughs> Is that it? I think that's it. Yeah, okay. So we won the battle. We gained some morale. Let's gain some honor as well. I didn't check how many men did we lose. We actually, I don't think we lost a single person there. That was actually very, very good. Yeah, excellent. Anyone ready to upgrade? No? Okay. <laughs> Uh, so, as planned, we will be heading straight to Iwaki Castle to visit our lady. I think 13 days is plenty. Uh, let's head up there. Is there a city on our way there? I keep saying city. I'm so sorry. I'm not even gonna apologize anymore. I'm just gonna say whichever comes to mind first. Usually it's city for whatever reason. Alright, so we should probably head to Edo. Just to check the inn as well, because I really want to get rid of these prisoners, because I know that they actually decrease our speed on the world map. There we go, the slaver. Uh, train spearmen. Ooh, those were very, very nice. The veteran ones were 140 each. Woohoo. Just out of curiosity, is there a tournament anytime soon in Hamamata? Okay, so we just came from there. It matters not to us. All right, let's head to Iwaki Castle. Afterwards, we will... Hmm. I think that next episode, we will head to Mito. Possibly Choshi. Wait, uh, since we're already going past Choshi, let's just go in there and actually check what our standing in Choshi is. Because if it's on zero, we're not gonna bother. Uh, train Onabushi is ready to become a veteran Onabushi. What is our... I mean, a four... That's... That's, that's worth coming back to. It actually is. Alright, so we will be coming back to Choshi. Caravan versus... Okay, so we're not gonna help him attack a caravan because that's just barbaric. Uh, we will help against lords, though. Alright, so Mito... And Mito is at zero, apparently. Alright. But it's the closest one to Iwaki Castle, so I think we're still gonna... Actually, hmm. 29,000... We can't really be splurging as much anymore, really. I know that in about a week or two we'll be getting like an additional 800 from those guys and we'll actually be in the green. But you know what? We're actually gonna hold off on Choshi and Mito. Yeah, we're actually gonna hold off. Let's go visit our lady. And yes, this episode is yet another longer episode exactly because of the things that we're doing. We're not exactly doing uh, a lot, and I actually want us to uh, get to a certain good point. Attempt to visit a lady. Lady Hina, wait by the spring. Let's go. Take a little walk to her. There she is. Oh, she's lovely. Let's sit down. 
Hello, Lady Hina. Uh, do you like poetry? Do I have anything else I can... No? Okay. Do we have a future? Uh, perhaps it is best that we would never allow it. Perhaps I may still change your bird's mind. Alright, so she does not have a suitor, which is good. Which is very good. Um, who is here currently? Nobody. Let me check. Lord Hosoya. I hear... Wait, what? I hear that you've been paying suit to Lady Hina. Let me tell you something. I had my eye on that one ever since I was... I was a lass. Well, I mean. <laughs> and she was a lass. She's a highborn lady of this domain and should not be dem demeaned by your crude attentions. Keep away from her or expect to pay the price. Um... Sure, I'll pay the price. Alright, so apparently we just found our lady suitor. <laughs> we were right to come back when we did. We are going to challenge him to a duel, and we are going to defeat him. But before that... God damn it, where is he? Uh, I wish to ask you something. The location of Great Lord Date, Shirakawa, at the moment. Where is Shirakawa? There it is. Let's see if we can find him. Up. Oh! No, that's... Oh, that's Kojuro. Katakura Kojuro. The right-hand man of the Dokugandryu. A.K.A. Date Masamune. Uh, I wish to ask you something. Where is Great Lord Date now? Utsunomiya Castle. God, we're just chasing down the guy now. Where? Utsunomiya... Okay, so what? They're besieging that place. Alright, so of course Hosoya being useless. Just walking around instead of actually helping his lord. I am clearly the better lord. Or rather, the better man. Ah, uh, Shiraishi... Where is... God, can I just click... Where is Great Lord Date? For the love of God! Lord Oniniwa... Great Lord Date, finally! Here we go, guys! <clears throat> My Lord, I've come to offer you my sword and vassalage. You are known as a brave man at arms, and a fine leader of Manoto. I shall be pleased to accept your Naginata into my service and bestow, va bestow vassalage upon you, if you're ready to swear loyalty to me. I am ready, my lord. Good. Then repeat the words of the oath with me. I swear loyalty to you as lawful ruler of the Dati clan. I pledge loyalty to you as lawful ruler of the Dati clan. I will remain as your loyal and devoted man as long as my breath remains, and I will be at your side to fight your enemies should you need my sword. Finally, I will uphold your lawful claims and those of your legitimate heirs. Very well. You've given me your solemn oath, Oto. May you uphold it always with proper courage and devotion. Let it be known that from this day forward you are my sworn man and vassal. I give you my protection and grant you the right to bear arms in my name, and I pledge that I shall not deprive you of your life, liberty, or properties, except by the lawful judgment of your peers, or by the law and custom of the land. Furthermore, I give you the fief of Hitachi, with all its rents and revenues. You have done a wise thing, Otto. Serve me well, and I promise you will rise high. Thank you, Lord. Wow, okay, so certain people like us, certain people absolutely hate us. <laughs> I have great hopes for you, Otto. I know you shall prove yourself worthy of the trust I have placed in you. Alright, so. Uh, our <laughs> faction relations. Actually, let's, no, 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 no. We, we will do it like this. Because I didn't see, no, not like this, uh, factions. Dati clan. Alright, so. There's a risk of war. Truce. Okay, so we're at war with the Nambu clan. 
Satomi clan and Saito clan alright so the Satomi are these guys so basically Choshi alright so good thing we actually didn't bother with Choshi the Nanbu clan or no way that's the Mogami those are the Nanbu which is a problem we should have actually have gone to Nipote first and then come down to swear our allegiance <laughs> oh well and the uh, Saito clan which are these guys so those guys aren't really gonna be a problem Toshi might be a bit of a problem I mean the what are they Satomi clan might be a slight problem the Nambu clan you're just in my way <laughs> that is the problem but at any rate we are officially a part of the Date clan and we will officially begin taking part in the battles to come. Thank you very much guys for sticking around for as long as you have. Finally, we are in the so-called mid-game. We're gonna start increasing our relationships with Lords. Uh, We're going to start battling it out a lot, lot more. Also, it's probably a good idea to actually start getting you know, a few samurai for ourselves. Speaking of which, where actually is Hitachi? Oh, lovely! He gave me a looted village. That is absolutely wonderful of you, Great Lord Date. But at least it's close to Iwaki Castle, so I will be close to my lady. At any rate, guys, like I said, thank you very much for sticking around for as long as you did. I have been Kaiser, and I will see you guys next time. Until then, as always... Ad Gloriam.